I want to come back to that intervention options decision tree that I presented to you earlier in this course. And um, as I mentioned there, those green diamonds represent different populations or characteristics of children with speech sound disorders um, so that we don't have one approach fits all kids um, because they're going to come with different uh, characteristics and, and needs. So I want to go through a couple of these just very briefly. Um, there are other resources that you can refer to, um, including a book that I co-edited with Sharon McLeod and Rebecca McCauley on interventions for speech sound disorders in children that has chapters related to these different approaches and videotape examples. But let's take a look at what approaches would be appropriate um, for young children? And, and I mentioned this briefly before. Um, these are children two to four years of age who have a small phonetic inventory. And um, one approach that is specifically designed for this population is the stimulability approach by Adele Michio. And um, the characteristic of this approach is that you want to increase their inventory by making sounds stimulable. So it is a short-term transitional approach that your goal is just to make these sounds stimulable. And we know from research that once sounds become stimulable, they're more likely to come in on their own. Mm -hmm. 